once the largest library in the ancient world and containing works by the greatest thinkers and writers of times, including Homer, Plato, Socrates, and many more, the Library of Alexandria in northern Egypt is popularly believed to have been destroyed in a huge fire and its voluminous works lost. So what exactly happened to this amazing storehouse of ancient knowledge and who was responsible? The prime suspect in destruction of the Library of Alexandria is Julius Caesar. Scholars believe that during Caesar's occupation of the city of Alexandria in 48 BCE, he found himself cornered by the Egyptian fleet in the harbor. For his own safety, he had his men set fire on the Egyptian ships. But the fire got out of control and spread to the parts of the city, including the area where the library was located. Another suspect is the Muslim, Caliph Omar. In 640 AD, when the Muslims conquered the city of Alexandria, Caliph supposedly ordered the library to be burnt down, fearing that it might have information that contradicts the Quran.